So today in this video, I'm gonna be going over why the Osmo Pocket is probably the only camera I will ever use again to do vlogging. Well, daily vlogging, so stay tuned. So as I stated, stated, the Osmo Pocket is gonna be the only camera I ever use again to do any vlogging with. By vlogging, I mean daily vlogging, like walking around, you need to pull a camera out real fast. Like I could probably use my phone, but honestly, this is way more convenient than, than using my phone, believe it or not. Um, just because your phone, it's, it's not as, this is just ergonomically correct. I mean, the way this feels in your hand is just simply amazing. Uh, the footage this thing takes, the 4K60 is, ultra smooth it does 100 megabits per second which is uh, amazing 100 megabits per second the higher the megabit uh the bit rate you just essentially send more information to the file it's a larger file but you get a better picture um so like a standard uh the camera i'm shooting on right now the sony i'm filming in 4k 100 megabits a second i can also dumb it down to 60 megabits a second if i wanted a smaller file uh 4k so this doing 100 megabits, amazing. It does slow motion at 120, which you know, uh, but you have to go down to 1080p. But the 60 frames a second at 4K is a huge selling point for me. And the gimbal, again, is a huge selling point for me. I know I have the Hero 7, which is right here, but again, this is just way, 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 just feels way better in your hand than this does. The onboard audio on this is amazing, as you can tell by my other videos I shot on the Osmo Pocket, which all my latest vlogs have been shot on this. Obviously the drone footage is not shot with the Osmo Pocket, but again, like I said, for vlogging wise, you don't vlog with a drone. You just use that for some B-roll footage. Does send a like D now, so what that means, you know, um, it, it kind of flattens out the picture with the color, and you can add color grading later for even better quality. This is almost a cinema quality camera that you can fit in your pocket. And it's just so convenient that that's why this will be my go-to. The battery lasts for a while. Like, I know I've said it time and time before, but it fits in this little case, slides in your pocket. I can also put my phone in the same pocket. I put my keys in this pocket. Like, it doesn't take up much room at all. And it, it just feels so good in your hand. So if you had to pick and buy a camera solely for vlogging, this is, the camera you want to buy. I've even shot cooking videos on this camera. Like that's how versatile this is. It does have a lot of accessories that came out for it. Um, I'm putting a link up there for the accessories, but the accessories, a lot of them aren't out yet. Um, I actually got in touch with DJI and talked to them and they said they're going to be dropping probably April or June-ish. So they're just having a little bit of issues getting the parts made, all these new tariffs and whatever. I don't know. As they're trying to tell me, um, I think they just, they're still trying to work out some kinks. Um, you can hook an external mic up to this, obviously, which I would like to do if I'm going to be doing a lot of vlogging, but the only problem with the external mic is if you have the external mic plugged in, you can't put it back in the case. So you can't, you know, like a lot of times you, you're vlogging, you pull a camera out, you start shooting, put it away, put it in your pocket. You don't have the camera out 100% of the time. So uh, for vacations, again, this is the go-to camera for daily whatever go-to camera um i have the mounts i have this accessory the scroll wheel which it's cool and all but i really don't use it much um the mount that i do use is this mount um, which is really good for vlogging if you want to uh, do some car vlogs you get this and then you can hook it onto your gopro mounts that hook into your car so you can hook it onto your windshield and just talk while you're driving so you're not you know holding a camera but this is the go-to camera, $350 price point. I would highly, highly, highly recommend buying this. If you're serious about vlogging, want to start vlogging, want to start making YouTube videos, um, just want a quality camera for a very, very low cost. I mean, the cost of a DSLR, you're looking at probably at least $400, $500 just for the body of the camera. Then you gotta buy a lens, and then you gotta buy a microphone, and then you gotta you know, buy a gimbal, and then you gotta, it's it just, and it's huge. I mean, another thing about this for vlogging, it's not very intrusive. Like when somebody sees you with this, they're not going to essentially be so uncomfortable with you filming around them. Because when you're in large groups of people, a lot of times when you're, you have a camera out, a lot of people feel uncomfortable. They're, they think that you're going to put them out and they're going to be like, I don't know, it, there's something about it. Obviously, the, the realization that they're actually going to be seen by somebody they know is highly unlikely unless you're super, super popular. But again, this very, 
discreet, not very intrusive. You can pretty much take this anywhere you want and film and nobody even knows you're doing. You can turn to flashlight mode and you can hold it down at your side and it'll like, it'll put the, uh, the lens up this way. Let me try to get this. It'll go like this. Okay, so you can literally hold it down on your waist and they'll no, have no idea you have a camera out. So very discreet, very compact, very nice in your hand, feels great. Uh, it just, everything at the touch of touch of, a, of, of your thumbs. Like it, it's literally the best camera that I have ever used as far as daily use camera. You don't have hardly any setup. I mean, what's the setup? I don't say hit the button. 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, 4, 1,000. Four seconds, the camera's ready to go. And that is a no-brainer to me. So again, hope this video helped. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. We have a lot of videos uh, about the Osmo Pocket, a lot of videos about the GoPro, a lot of videos of just about electronics in general, uh, cooking videos. We have all kinds of videos. This channel is growing substantially, and we would love you to be a part of it. So uh, yeah, like it, share it, subscribe. Says one for life. Peace and you're welcome.